Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're told that a cardiac monitor is used to measure the heart rate of a patient after surgery. It compiles the number of heartbeats after t minutes. When the data and table are graphed, the slope of the tangent line represents the heart rate in beats per minute. So we have our points here. We're told the monitor estimates this value by calculating the slope of a secant line. Use the data to estimate the patient's heart rate after 42 minutes using the secant line between the points and the given values of t. So we're asked to create a secant line between the points at t equals 42 and 36, 38, 40, and 44. So first we do 36. So the point 36, 25, 30 corresponds to t equals 36 and a total heartbeat accumulated up to that point of 2,530. And then 42, 2,948. And the slope of the secant line is just the slope between these two points. So our slope m is the change in y. So 2,948 minus 2,530 over the change in x, 42 minus 36. And so we just calculate this here. And we say 2,948 minus 2,530 is 418 divided by 6. And this is equal to 2,000, sorry, not 2,000, my calculator messed up, 69 and 2 thirds, so 0.67. This is the heart rate, the heartbeats per minute, based off of this secant line. So you take your two points, you calculate the slope between the two points, and that gives you the heart rate. And I have calculated for the three other points ahead of time, just because it's the same process, but you take your two points, find the slope between them, and that is simply your answer for t equals 36 and 42, 38 and 42, 40 and 42, and 42 and 44. And we can see that the values are 69 and 2 thirds, 71 and 3 quarters, 71 and 66.